When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Hi and welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, hi, welcome to my channel. Today's video will be a clean with me, just a, a simple and clean with me, nothing uh, specific. I just had a lot of things to do in the house. I was not able to get everything done that I wanted to get done as always, but I still got a lot of things done. I filmed this video over two days because I was um, cleaning up on Saturday morning. Um, this is the clip you see here and then I um, ended up doing the rest of the things um, on Sunday. So that's why you will see a little outfit change. If you're new to this channel I want to take a second to introduce myself. So my name is Rebecca. I am 23 years old and I am a stay-at-home mom of a 13-month-old baby girl that is named Paulina. I am married to Patrick that you have seen in the intro as well as our dog Ellie. Um, so yeah, we are a family of three and a dog right now. We live in Germany and I um, have videos about my journey as a young mom as well as everything homemaking on my channel so if you're interested in those kind of videos please consider hitting the red subscribe button and if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up as you have seen i started by taking down our sheets um, because i really wanted to give them a good wash and i always try to do this right in the morning because they always take a while to dry um, i started them in the washing machine right away i also had a load of laundry in the washer so i started to dry as well and then i had a few things out of the washing machine that had to get hung up and as you can see i had a lot of laundry that was dry that i was taking down um and you will see me folding the laundry on sunday actually so yeah at the end of the video you, you will see me folding all of this laundry So after I threw the sheets into my washing machine, I ended up cleaning up the kitchen because we already had breakfast and a snack, so Pauline had a snack, um, that I made in the kitchen, obviously, and so it was not that clean and I was not able to get it done right after breakfast. Um, on this particular weekend, Patrick was actually working and... Um, yeah, so I had to take care of Paulina on my own on this Saturday morning, um, which is unusual for us. So yeah, I was not able to clean up after breakfast yet. Um, on this time, Paulina was currently on a walk with um, my mom and Ellie. So that's why I had some time to get my household chores done before she came back.
Okay, so in a second you will see me putting the sheets back on our bed. So it was already um, the evening when I filmed the clip that you will see after cleaning up this dining area. Um, yeah, and maybe you wonder why Pauliner's crib is in our room currently. So we actually had a problem with mold in her room. Um, yeah, so we now had a um, specific man here that is like for uh, mold problems in houses and construction, all of kind of things. And um, so for right now, we finally have 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 not have we don't have the problem with the mold anymore because we yeah just took care of it so that's good and yeah but on this day her crib was was still in our room because she was obviously not in her room anymore um yeah that's just why so i had to hurry up with the sheets a little bit because it was just before her bedtime and and I was not able to get into our room after that and I really did not want to did they do this um, when it's completely dark in this room and she's sleeping so yeah I just went ahead and did this while Patrick was getting Paulina ready for bed So as you can see, it was the next day and I just started off in our master bathroom. Um, it really has been a while since I really gave it a good clean. So I started with the toilet, um, I also did the, the sink and the shower. Um, yeah, but I was not doing the bathtub in this on this particular day because the bathtub was the only thing I did only a few days ago so I decided to no <laughs> I don't want to do the bathtub again I yeah shower and bathtub I think they might be um, the things that I hate the most <laughs> in household chores I don't know it is just something I really 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 don't like and this day was a day of um, not being able to film myself cleaning up um, the mirrors. I don't know what it was. You can see it here. I just totally forgot that I've already um, put my camera the way that you see me cleaning up the sink and I forgot to just put it in the right angle that you can see me cleaning up the mirror and it will be a problem again later when I'm in our hallway. I actually completely forgot to put on the camera um, and to click on the play button when, not the play button, the record button, um, when I was cleaning the big mirror in our hallway and you will only see me cleaning up the little one because I recognized when I um, set up the new angle for the little mirror, but yeah. It is how it is sometimes, um, especially because I was a little bit in a rush. Um, yeah, I was forgetting about things like that. <laughs> I'm 
body language Working on our body language Baby, now tell me exactly how you feel I'm just trying to keep it real Let me love you on the inside Love you on the inside Tell me exactly what you mean You mean everything to me Let me love you on the inside And same problem as always, I still don't know how to film myself cleaning up the shower, so if you have any ideas or recommendations, please let me know because I really don't know and I really struggle with that. Um, yeah, so you only always see me like little bits of the cleaning process because yeah, it is just a struggle. <laughs> and. You will see me in a second um, finally getting rid of all of the Valentine's decor. I had it up for way too long um, and the coffee bar, cacao bar area was actually um, super dusty and there were like grounded coffee everywhere. So I really gave it a good clean and just left it super simple and clean and i really like how it turned out because yeah um i just was over this cluttered space um i loved it when i did it and i think it really was pretty but sometimes you're just over it and yeah so we just keep it super simple and clean for a while and then we'll see what i do with spring decor and easter decor i'm already planning about that um but i think i will keep my house pretty clean and simple for spring and easter we'll see maybe i would change my mind and put up like all of my decor and i don't know go out we will see but i don't think so so stay tuned for my spring and easter decor i hope that this will come pretty soon So that was Sunday evening and Paulina was in bed, Pedro was still working um, and I decided to just go ahead and yeah, fold I think three or four loads of laundry. Um, I was watching some of my YouTube friends on the iPad while I was folding my laundry. This is um, something I always do because it just gets me motivated and um, yeah it is just so nice to watch all of them while doing a chore like laundry I don't mind folding laundry so much it is just a chore I'm yeah it's not like cleaning the shower at the top <laughs> obviously and absolutely not um, no I think you can make it enjoyable for yourself but yeah, that's just how I do it. I always watch some YouTube friends or maybe a show sometimes um, to just make it way more enjoyable and relaxing. 
in the evening especially because I don't know it's just a chore I tend to do in the evening. Please tell me in the comments below what is your favorite and your least favorite chore that you have to do in your household. I would love to know that. And do you have a way to make not so enjoyable tasks more enjoyable for yourself? So we're already at the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it gave you some motivation. Maybe you have even cleaned along with me. If you did so, please let me know what you've got accomplished in this time. And if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. You can also check out my Instagram. Um, I'm going to put my Instagram name down in the description box. And I would love to see you in the next video. Have a great day and a great rest of the week. We will see each other at Sunday. So yeah, have a wonderful week.